Hey guys, welcome back to All in a Law. In this video, I'm going to talk about the signs and symptoms of moderate acute asthma. Okay, right. So, what are the signs and symptoms? In previous video, we discussed about the um, signs and symptoms of uh, mild acute asthma, and in this video, we're going to talk about the moderate acute asthma. And in the next video, we're going to talk about the severe signs and symptoms of severe acute asthma. Right. So, in this, remember the color of the patient. Okay, is normal means you don't see any pal, pallor. Right. Sensorium. He looks anxious. He looks anxious. Okay. The respiratory rate. The respiratory rate is going to be raised in moderate. Even in mild also, right? And dyspnea. Can speak in phrases, remember. Okay. It's gonna be moderate what you call you can speak in phrases okay right then accessory muscles as they are not involved in uh, mild whereas in moderate there's a chest in drawing and flaring up of LNAZ Just in drawing and flaring of alanesi. Okay. And the pulses paradoxes is around ten to twenty millimeter. Okay. And the wrong chi. And the wrong chi will be both the expiratory and the inspiratory. P E F R peak expiratory flow rate is around less than eighty. That is sixty to eighty. Remember, this is really very important. This is gonna help you easily so that you can divide the and the asthma into mild, moderate, and severe. And saturation SAO2 will be around 90 to 95. Still, the saturation is good, but it has come down below the 95, right? So, in the next video, we're going to talk about the signs and symptoms of the severe acute asthma. This is for a medical school, uh, med school student, okay, and even for those who are preparing for the USMLE examination, just a kind of a revision, right guys? So thank you so much for watching this video, take care.